All right, here's a quick video to show you how to record your vocals with reverb, whether you have a low latency interface or you're using a direct monitoring solution because your interface is a high uh, latency setup. So the first setup would be if you had a low latency interface like a Firewire unit with the buffer all the way down to 64 or 32 buffer. And how you'd set that up would be uh, select your input for your vocal and then we want to record enable it and then we want to click on the monitoring button right here so you can hear your software's sound and then we want to obviously put a reverb unit onto our reverb channel and we want to make a send just by drag and dropping and then putting the signal all the way up or up as much as you want and now you see our signals going through there that's setup one and now let's get rid of that and we'll show you setup two so I'm gonna get rid of the send and I'll just leave the reverb unit there cuz I'm gonna need it anyway so this is for if you have a high latency interface and you're using direct monitoring on a USB interface or something else or like I was doing the last couple of weeks I was using an external soundboard for my monitoring um, so I needed to hear my reverb from the program and this is how I went about that you turn the monitoring off for your channel that you're recording so it's still going to record but you're just not going to hear the input so you won't get that weird doubling effect with your direct monitoring and then you want to record enable your reverb send or you want to record enable your reverb channel so now we have signal on both and you also want to in enable the monitoring for your reverb channel so now you're going to start hearing your reverb channel with whatever latency that your interface has so if your interface has you know 30 milliseconds of delay you probably won't want to add in the pre-delay on your reverb unit so for this example I'll just turn this down to zero so also we're not going to want to record onto this reverb channel here so we'll want to right click on the record button and then check off record disable so now if we go and we record here you're going to see that this is not recording you know useless reverb sound that we don't want thanks for watching tutorials for reaper this is johnny from red sneaker records